Hey guys, how's everybody doing? Um, I'm going to give you a special treat today. This is going to be a quick tour around the little town of Juliet, Georgia. It's down near Macon, Georgia. And it's uh, the town that um, the movie Fried Green Tomatoes was filmed in. Um, and it was in the movie. It was called, um, they called it Whistle Stop. So, I um, wonder if any of you guys have seen Fried Green Tomatoes, and if any of you are fans, and if so, you might enjoy this look around. We'll have a look inside the Whistle Stop Cafe and uh, all the little, around, all the little shops in town. It's really uh, pretty much out in the middle of nowhere. It's really off the beaten path, and uh, just thought you might, uh, might enjoy seeing that. It's um, a little piece of history here. And I actually need to go uh, rent the movie again and, and watch it. I've forgotten the names of all the characters. I know we had uh, Ruth and Iggy and George, and um, but I've forgotten a lot of the others. So I'm gonna I'm gonna try to look up that movie. I think I've got it on VHS. I don't have it on DVD, but I'm gonna have a look at it. Okay, here's a here's a look around uh, town. Local honey for sale. It's the honeycomb. And what do we have here? Let's see. It's just a little lodge, and then here's the Honeysuckle Cafe, Papa Joe's Peddler, there's uh, it says Whistle Stop, and I guess the name of the town was Whistle Stop, and it's collectibles, home decor, candles, and there's the train depot, there's the old drugstore, old bank, Liberty Bank, and right here, there's the old Whistle Stop Cafe from the movie. These guys probably get tired of all these tours coming through here. Okay, we'll, well, I'll show you more of that, but um, let's see. There's a tool and parts store. There's some guy sitting on a bench. Um, ironworks. But that's pretty much the town. Um, we're going to turn around and go back and let you see the um, more of the more of the cafe. I don't remember all the names of the characters from the movie, but Izzy, I wasn't Izzy, I think she was one of the main characters. And I think right out there to the side there, that's where they um, cooked up the barbecue. And you remember they uh, remember them saying it's hog killing time after after the uh, the man got killed in the movie. And I think they barbecued him up and they were always in there. The sheriffs was in there and all the people were in the restaurant. And they said, uh, Talking about how good that barbecue was, and I think they were eating that old, that mean man from the movie, and they kept saying the secrets in the sauce. But anyway, that's it. Uh, fried green tomatoes, uh, served hot, it says. And I actually ate there once a few years back. It was actually still a cafe, and it may be today. I don't know. As I always thought it was a great movie. And, uh, well, unfortunately, I don't remember all the characters and all the details about the movie, but for you uh, folks that like the movie, this is a look around Whistle Stop which is actually the town of Juliet. Let's go up and have a look in. So there's a look inside. We're looking through the old glass window, but uh, looks just like it did in the movie. Got the old wooden benches in there. Right back there is where they uh, cooked up the fried green tomatoes and all the vegetables in the movie. There we go, there's the Ruth and Iggy gift shop. Ruth and Iggy were the two main characters in the movie. Who else do you have? You had Ruth and Iggy and George and uh, 
Gosh, I don't know. I need to watch the movie again.